Hey YouTube, it's GayGeek85 here with my haul from Walker Stalker Con Orlando. Um, this past weekend was Walker Stalker Con Orlando and it was at the Orange County Convention Center. Um, I did go. Um, I did go and for the first time at a Walker Stalker Con, which this is my third. I was a, I did the gold pass. Um, There's just a lot of people I wanted to meet and I had been saving up between this and the last con I went to. I saved up and I figured why not. Um, when you got the gold pass, when you got a VIP pass, you did get this really cool poster. Shane, he ended up canceling once again. This will be the, like, fourth con in a row. He's canceled on me, but, so he wasn't there, but all the other people were. No one else canceled. And I had an amazing time. I, I think it's been my favorite con to go to, not so much because of who I met, because some of my favorites weren't there, but more because just it, the atmosphere was really fun. Um, for the first time, um, they started with, um, these exclusive Walker Soccer Con pins that I guess they're going to do at every con, and, um, I think there was 200 made, and I managed to nab one when I finally did find the official Walker Soccer Con store. For some reason, I kept missing it. Um, it was the only one left on the table, so I'm not sure if I got the last one or if they just didn't put more out. Um, also, before we get into autographs and stuff, I did, um find the AMC store that had the official AMC merchandise and they had the first official Carol shirt um it says in Carol we trust with one of the season five promo shots um and it was the only official merch that they had with a that was character specific that wasn't Rick or Daryl or Majone so that was kind of cool that Carol's like the first one to really get and then, of course, um, I got, they had the Walker Stalker Con shirt that you got with your VIP pass. And on the back, it has all of the recent Walker Stalker Cons listed. And, yeah. Okay, and then we'll get into autographs. Um, I did meet Andrew J. West again. This is my second time meeting him. And what was cool is that he remembered me actually from um, meeting him in Orlando. And I got him, one of the autographs I got him to do was I got him to sign the Gareth figure. And then I did meet um, Daniel, and I forget his last name. He's the one who played Aiden, um, Deanna's son. Really nice guy. Um, Lenny James, who played Morgan. I was in my um, Carol cosplay, so um, that's why he wrote Melissa would be happy, because... He really liked my cosplay, and he said she would too. Um, I met Tova um, Feldsha, who um, plays Deanna. She was super sweet. She was super small. Like, she doesn't look as short on TV as she is. In, she's a very tiny woman. Um, Caitlin Nakin, who um, also um, sang some of her songs live at one of the panels, and she had a really great voice. Um, Shane wasn't there. I would have gotten him to sign this, but he was not there, so I couldn't. But I did get to meet Anna, um, Emma Bell, who played Amy. Um, Tyler Kennedy, who played Mika. Um, from Elizabeth Mitchell from Once Upon a Time, she played the Snow Queen. And also, she was Juliet on Lost. Um, Addie Miller, who played, um, Teddy Bear Girl. Um, uh, my friend who went with me to the con actually volunteered at the con and he worked her table and they got along really good um ross who plays aaron um michael um Cudlet, who plays abraham josh mcdermott who plays eugene and then i also got gareth um andrew west to sign his season five promo because i just really liked it so i figured why not Probably, I would say she was my favorite I met over the weekend. Um, I have met her in Atlanta the first year, but I actually was able to talk to her more. She actually took a picture of me and posted it on her Instagram, which was really exciting for me. And um, we got to talk. She talked with me for a while about Karen and about her character on Teen Wolf and just about random things. She was really sweet. If you ever are at a con Melissa Ponzio is at, I definitely suggest you stop by and say hi. 
Um, it was exciting because, as far as I know, um, Jane McNeil, who played Patricia, has done none of the other Walker Soccer Cons yet. Um, Orlando was her first. And as of right now, I don't believe she's announced for any other one. So it was cool to um, have a guest that doesn't do many cons. And then Alexandra, who plays Jesse. I've been a fan of hers since American Horror Story because, for those American Horror Story fans know, she is... Um, on the, a big character on the first season, and um, she's a really sweet lady. Um, Colin Moss, who plays Officer Gorman, who, yes, his character was a pervert, but he's a very sweet guy, and um, he liked my Carol cosplay too. And he, it was funny, it was he was giving out green lollipops. Um, one of my my probably tied up there with Melissa as excited as like who I just loved talking to was Jordan Woods Robinson who plays Eric. Um, he's just a really great guy and he's another one I'd highly suggest you um, meet. Bob, he wrote Tainted Meat, which I thought was pretty funny. Um, Lawrence Gillard, he's another... They, everyone's so nice. Um, I got to meet Tyler, who plays Noah. Michael, who plays Nicholas. Another um, one who just recently started doing the Walker Stalker cons is Gerald, who plays Jackie. And Seth Gillum, Father Gabriel. And now getting into the photo ops. Um, it's me and my Carol cosplay from The Grove with Melissa Ponzio, who plays Karen, and my friend Andy, who is working with Addie Miller. And then here's me with uh, Jane McNeil. Uh, here is me with Alexandra. And then the Bob and Gareth photo op. Here's with Elizabeth Mitchell. Soniqua, or Sasha. Lenny James, Morgan. Uh, they did uh, Aaron and Eric duo, which was probably my favorite of the weekend. Well, this, either this one or the one of um, Lizzie and Mika in my Carol cosplay. I got one with Alana, Tara. Another one with Andrew West, because I'm just in love with Andrew West. And um, Gerald. And then I did go to Emily Kinney's concert where I got a signed copy of her CD, but unfortunately it got, um, it got smudged. Sorry, I was picking something up. And the only other things that I did get was I am, I have the season five cast poster. Sorry. Sorry, I do have the season five cast poster, and I've been slowly getting um, signatures. I did get Alana Masterson to sign it. Um, Norman Reedus had already signed it at MegaCon this year. And then I did get Emily Kinney. And the last one was um, Christian Serrato signed it. So, so far I have four. And hopefully, if I get to go to Atlanta, which is the plan, I will get as many more as I can. I'm definitely get Melissa, who was the one I wanted to sign at first, but unfortunately, I haven't had a chance to see her since I've gotten the poster. But that's it. That's my haul, and that's my ramblings. If um you guys want to see more pictures, like um table selfies and stuff I took, you can go ahead and um follow my Gaggy Gate Five page on Facebook, where I posted all my pictures. And that is pretty much it. So until next time, this is Gay Geek 5 Y'all have a good one.